Good morning, Dos Pueblos. I'm Colleen Murphy. And I'm Nate Lara, and DP News starts now. Seniors, tomorrow from 9 to 10 a.m., the University of Redlands will be visiting us in the library. Also on Wednesday, the University of Oregon will be visiting us in the library from 9 to 10 a.m., so be sure to stop by if you're interested at all. Hey all you gardeners, cleaners, helpers, and students extraordinaire. Our first Speedify DP is this Saturday from 9 a.m. to noon. NHS students are required to go to at least one of these events, so we hope to see you out there. These hours can also instead be put towards your graduation requirements. So if any of you seniors are scraping by for extra hours, please stop by. And now, over to Alex Mackey, our senior magazine sales correspondent. Hey guys, I'm Alex, back with more magazine information. We're about a week into selling our magazines now, and hopefully you're still out there trying to get those subscriptions sold. And um, I also have an update on your top five classes. Class number one is Lewin, first period. Class number two is Sherman, second period. Class number three is Rattel, fifth period. Class number four is York, first period. And class number five is Lewin, fifth period. Keep selling those magazines. You may have been hearing about the new curriculum and design learning within our classrooms, and some of you may have experienced the shift to the common core standards. The standards are a clear set of shared goals and expectations for what knowledge and skills will help you succeed. Go visit the front of the library during lunch all week to pick up your printed school photos if you got any special packages. Several leadership students will be handing them out all week at lunch, so go and get those photos so you can give them to your mom, your grandma, your crush of the week, or your bus driver. If you don't come and pick them up this week, there is a chance they might be framed and posted in the Greek. That's all I'm saying. So it's your move, Chargers. Everyone go out to Hollister Brewing Company today for some lunch, dinner, or even takeout to support the girls, DP Girls Volleyball. Stop by Coach Garrett's room near the Greek to grab your flyers so you could help support these awesome girls before their home game on Thursday. Anyone out there looking to earn some more community service hours? Or maybe you just love lemons. Maybe you just want a free t-shirt. Well, whatever your case, the Lemon Festival is looking for some extra volunteers for shifts on this Sunday. If you're interested, go talk to Mr. Gutentag in the counseling office or in P2 to get some more information. And now, a word from Vice Principal Bill Worded. Mr. Worded states, by now, all the students should have received a copy of the school's academic integrity contract from their English teachers. These contracts must be signed, and your parent slash guardian must return these to your English teachers no later than Friday, or earlier if your teachers are requesting it. If you lost your form, please go see Ms. Mills in the administration office, and she can give you a new form. Thank you, Mr. Worded. Go visit the library during 6th and after lunch today for a meet and greet with DP alumni and New York Times reviewed author Teddy Steinkellner as he talks about his new published book, Trash Can Days. It should be a fun time, so come on out. And we have a very special birthday shout out to our homegirl, Wei Joan Uden. Girl, you have a good birthday, Wei Joan. Your little sister, Wei Sun, wishes, wishes you the happiest of days. And all of us in leadership are lucky to have such a great gem as you in our class. We love you, Wei Joan. Well, all right, Chargers, that's all we have for your news today. I'm Nate Lara. And we'll smell you later, DP. Now over to Brittany for some sports. Hey, DP, it's Brittany with your sports. Over the weekend, our cross-country team ran in the Woodbridge Invitational. Cole Smith came in second place with a time of 14.44. John Greening came in 21st with, 21st with a time of 15.13. John was followed by Andrew McGuan in 27th with a time of 15.16. Chris Wischutin got 53rd with a, fifth, with a time of 15.38. And, ES, and Ian Wischutin got 54th and his time was 15.39. Other members of the team were Tyler Bradford who came in with a time of 16.01 and Sam Siebel who, came, who had a time of 15.17. Good job boys, keep up the great work. Also over the weekend, our boys water polo team got 11th in the Santa Barbara Invitational. Great job boys. Today, our girls' golf team plays at Glen Annie Golf Course against Santa Marcos. Good luck, girls. Also today, our girls' vars varsity tennis faces off DP Santa Marcos at DP. Come cheer on our girls. Good luck, everyone. 
Well, that's all the sports, DP. I'm Brittany. Have a great day.